guys, welcome back to another episode of Life Beyond the Pitch. My name is Aryan and this week we have Rishabh as our guest. So Rishabh, how did you start your cricket career? I started as a, like, I was starting in school. So my cricket coach was Bengali. Yeah, I mean, I'm Bengali. So yeah. my dad actually wanted me to play, you know, start cricket with him. And I wanted to play football, but yeah. I had asthma. So I couldn't do it. So I started with cricket and I got into it like that. You played the World Cup in the 19 squad. You want to talk to the experience, how was it? I was really good, you know, because you could like I could see the big players and stuff, you know, playing uh, like in front of me and how they prepare and stuff like that. You know, we got to know um, and we got to know how it is, you know, playing in the big stage, right? So it was a good experience and uh, yeah, it was really like fun too. That's great. What's your like iconic memory on that tour? Uh, on that tour, it would be the game we won against uh, New Zealand. Uh -huh. So like we we played all of us played really well you know, yeah mm -hmm. and it was like a complete team effort and that uh, like that game gave us confidence going into the World Cup yeah and, yeah so that'd be the most incredible uh, thing so the last year you've changed a lot you changed your action you changed entire bowling do you want to say like what what sort of things you did as an Austin bowler to make you more wicket taking uh, more aggressive I I I actually like when I first came into the team yeah I used to fly the ball ball a lot so that was kind of a weakness and uh, like advantage to me. Um, but then again, I had to kind of you know, like increase my pace a bit. So I worked my action. So I worked with Obi. Uh, so he helped me a lot. So transition from the World Cup qualifiers to World Cup, it's all because of him. And yeah, so because of him now, you know, I'm like, I'm able to do what I want to do on the field. So, so. I'm going to do a rapid fire round of Rishabh here. So we have 30 seconds on the clock and I'm a rapid fire ask you questions, yeah? So who's your funniest teammate? My funniest team is Vasisha. What's your most iconic memory on the field? It will be the one we won against Nepal by one run in the World Cup qualifiers. What's your first memory on the field? My first memory on the field uh, was my first game. I went in as a fast bowler and a batsman, so it was pretty funny. Do you, do you remember what happened that match? I don't remember, but I was no good. <laughs> it's okay. Okay, who's one young star to watch for the future? Uh, I would say uh, Ayan Khan. For now, he's a big name right now in the Donald Sixteen circuit. So. Okay. If you weren't playing cricket, what would you do? I would be a guitarist. I, I love playing my guitar. So. Yeah. This week's video is brought to you by Gulf Sea Sports. Gulf Sea Sports, as all you cricketers already know, is one of the best, if not the best, outlet for all your cricket equipment. They have provided talented cricketers with the best gear from all around the world, from selling Indian made brands like SS and SG to selling Australian made brands like Kookaburra and Focus. Gulf Sea Sports is your one stop for all your cricket equipment. One of the reasons they've become so successful is because they provide you with a wide range of companies to choose from and each of the bats are hand-picked and tailor-made according to the conditions here in the UAE. Gulsi Sports is one of the largest and most versatile outlet for cooker equipment here in the UAE. Furthermore, their exceptional customer service and great prices has made it the best outlet for you to go buy your equipment here in the UAE. So if you want to score hundreds in your next matches, visit Gulf Sea Sports in Sharjah at this location or call them at this number, then message on Instagram at Gulf underscore UAE underscore sports. So now we're going to do a cricket challenge. Me and Rishabh are going to do the traditional Austin challenge, try to hit the top of the off stump. So let's go to that. <laughs> 